Are you recording this? Hey, good afternoon, everyone. Uh, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today is Monday, June 10th, and the time right now is 6.15. For those who's kind of new to my YouTube channel, is that we do daily uh, portfolio review pretty much every day, and we do a daily group discussions every day. So as you look at on my left side here, uh, so all these guys here, uh, we, we meet up every day between 5 o'clock to 8 o'clock, and, and sometimes not necessarily me leading the discussion, other people lead the discussion. And this is how our community improve, and this is how we individually improve, because now we're taking our, our portfolio, our example, our questions, and we're getting um, the group discussion out of it. And uh, I, I always truly believe that if you, if, you, if you invest in a vacuum, yes, you can make money, you can do well. But can you imagine doing investment with the entire group? you got a whole community to help you, help each other, talking, debating, discussing, giving alternative choices, decision, and all that stuff. And, uh, and you will do well. Now, the one thing, though, because this is a high-dividend community, if you want a growth community, there's another Discord. If you want to talk about SEHD, there's another Discord. There's Discord for every community out there. But this community, we're talking about high-yield dividends. We're generating income through, uh, through some of these uh, dividends. All right? and, and we're doing really well. Uh, and, and that's why our, pop, our channel is just growing. Our popularity is growing. And we're combating all those haters, all those people who don't like us. And what we do is we combat it with the truth. We just show people our portfolio. At the end of the day, when I first started this journey, uh, let me just show you the portfolio from that perspective. When I started this journey, I made zero dollars back in 2023 because I, I put in 1500 in there. And then I just keep working my way up. And finally, I reached $92, almost $100. In July, I made $500, and all the way until December, I made $3,000, okay? In 2024, which is about six months ago, in January, I made $4,600. In February, I made $5,000. And in March, I made $6,000. In April, I made $6,693. In May, I made $7,000. In June, I'm going to make over $7,000, uh, pretty much going to be $8,000. And you're looking at July, $9,000. So... I remember when people were crushing my soul when I was making seven thousand. And I asked a question: Do you? How would you like to? Why, why you don't want seven thousand? I forgot what the name of the channel that uh, the the video was. It's something like uh, you don't want seven thousand dollars. Like it's like a question. Well, a lot of people were making fun of me of that. But guess what? I, I'm not making video about seven thousand anymore because my portfolio is still growing. It's always continuing to grow. Okay, it's grow. Not only that, grow a lot more. I remember I made a video call. Do you want three thousand dollars? Guess what? I'm not making three thousand dollars. I haven't make. I haven't talked about three thousand a long time, right? Because it's not happening. It's not happening. It doesn't go backward. It go forward, because the power of compounding is working. It's magic. So right now I'm on my way to make ten thousand dollars. Right? I'm a couple months away from making ten thousand, but I'm on pace to it. I'm going to reach eight thousand in in June, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna make nine thousand potentially in July. All right. It's crazy how fast these things move. And this is not an Excel spreadsheet. This is literally from my child Schwab account, right? This is actual money. Everything you look here is money. These are my income, right? And I'm looking the next 12 months, obviously this number is not going to be right because once I reach 10,000, it's going to be $120,000 a year. But I'm on pace to make $120,000 a year or $10,000 a month. And 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 then it, it's just crazy how fast it's compounding. Yes, go ahead and make fun of my you know seven thousand dollars a video, three thousand. And guess what? All those all those people they they're not even commenting in my section anymore. Not only I banned them, but you don't see people commenting negative comments anymore because at some point the math doesn't work anymore for you. You know the anti because here's the reality. Here's the reality uh, of this thing. If you, if you put whatever amount the money is and you're generating 50% yield, let's say you put $100,000, you're generating 50% yield. Well, in one year, you're going to get half of that money. You're going to get $50,000. Well, the second year, you're going to get $100,000. At some point, you know, because I'm going to year two. 
I'm going to go in year two. So yeah, it, it's it's crazy, and and a lot of people don't. That's why the number doesn't work. The the, the hater they don't crunch number anymore. Now they just attack me personally. My, they just personally attack me, and uh, they they don't. They used to they used to attack my portfolio, but what happened is the portfolio doesn't make sense because they kind of like when every time they crunch a number. They're like, oh my God, this guy's still making money. Because their argument is that yield max is going to fail. It hasn't failed. I'm going to lose money. It hasn't lose money. And not only that, it's it's going up faster. And then they think I'm going to end up holding back and the whole community is going to fail. Everybody's going to fail. And they're, they're the white knight coming to rescue every single person. Because not only that, I'm promoting a, a horrible fund, a horrible yield max. is the worst thing ever. But yield max continue to grow. They continue to be one of the biggest fun, uh, one of the fastest moving, fastest growing fun in in uh, essentially uh, the fun uh, in in uh, in uh, fund management group, whatever you call it, the ETF world of ETF. They they will not even rank, and I remember last year they were ranked fifty eight. I think they rank fifty one now, and they continue to get moving up. I mean, eventually they're going to move in the in the forties and the thirty because they keep growing and growing. And 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 people people like us were making money. A lot of us are making money. A lot of us getting richer and richer. Yeah. So, so I just want to share that perspective. Let's go look at my uh, position. <clears throat> All right. So my position, my portfolio is over two hundred thousand dollars. And right now I'm down forty one thousand dollars. That number is always going to go up because it's twenty percent of the portfolio. I'm down twenty percent. Why am I down 20%? Like I told you already, if Tesla is down, my portfolio is very Tesla heavy, very Tesla heavy, uh, because I own OOK, that's very Tesla heavy. I own TSLP, that's very Tesla heavy. I own TSLY, which is very Tesla heavy, and I own Tesla. So if, if Tesla go down, my portfolio is gonna, uh, my portfolio, the gain and loss is gonna be, it's gonna increase. So I'm down 20% because Tesla is down right now. You can see Tesla's down right now. Uh, down two percent, and um, and so if you minus forty one thousand, my total market value is one hundred fifty nine thousand. So if I sell everything, it's one hundred fifty nine thousand. Okay, and uh, my margin is seventy six thousand dollar. Now my because my portfolio is increasing, my margin balance increasing. So uh, so right now, if you, it's not even it's not even, you know, I keep using seventy percent of my margin. It's not seventy percent of my margin. So. Uh, I have a lot more money to to, to spend, uh, so yeah, I I can I'm not even maximizing my margin, all right? And uh, so, but it's seventy six thousand dollars I got paid back. I'm not worried about paying back my margin. When do I pay back? When I make ten thousand dollars a month, um, or more? Maybe I'm looking at thirteen or fifteen thousand dollars a month. That's when I pay back. But I'm not in a rush. Okay. So what happened if all the whole world? Well, guess what? Your markets, your stock go down, my stock go down, everybody go down. But if I need to sell it, I just sell, I just dump the entire Tesla because that's what I use my margin for to buy Tesla, okay? Um, and so far. And this portfolio is generating $8,000 a month right now and it's on its way to 9000 by July and then 10000 Okay, so this is third week. What is my game plan for the third week and what did I buy today? Uh, today I just bought a couple of target of opportunity. The reason why I bought it, uh, I didn't touch any of these guys. So the biggest thing happened today is uh, NVIDIA. Uh, uh, I bought one share. Now I have 10 share of NVIDIA. The current price is 121. It still continue to go up. So think about it. It's like $1,200. So it's continuing to go up. And, uh, and, and it's great. I got 10 shares. Uh, like, okay, that's, that's, that's awesome. So that's the biggest thing happened to my, uh, my, stock, my common stock. So I got, I got 10 shares. All right, so my income fund, so the rest of my money, um, so I have essentially 96% of my money in income fund. All these guys here produce, sole purpose is generate income, all right? Uh, in my income fund, leading the pack is Tesla. Tesla is 32% of my portfolio. When I started my journey, Tesla was 98% of my portfolio. 98% of my portfolio is sitting in Tesla. Guess what? I'm continually growing all the other fund. Once I grow the other fund, and uh, then my Tesla number will keep coming down. And, you know, so essentially when this number go to like 400,000, 500,000 and, uh, and 
Tesla number will come down. Okay, so a lot of people ask, where do I get the money to spend? Is it my salary money? See, when people invest in growth, they have to use their salary money or they have a rich uncle or uh, some drug business somewhere. I don't know where they get the money. But either way, one of the questions I always ask people when they try to debate with me, I say, okay, you can win the debate, number one. Number two, I only have one simple question. Where do you get the money to invest in growth stock? And their answer would be salary money. All right, for me, I haven't contributed my portfolio in a lot since January. I no longer touch my portfolio. I don't need to touch it anymore because I'm generating $8,000 of dividends and that's what I use to feed this thing. I just, I just put the money back in, all right? Now, I can withdraw. I withdraw uh, last month, uh, I mean, the beginning of the month, uh, in Janu uh, June, you know, to give money to, to my wife, put in a checking account. Yeah, so I withdraw some money. I withdraw money back in December last year. I withdraw the money during the wedding. I just withdraw money when I need to. And what I tell people all the time, man, is that everybody's really, at the end of the day, is their income investor. They just don't know it yet. Because why? Because real life has not happened to them yet. Emergency has not happened to them. No one died in their family yet. No one in the hospital yet. Nobody having cancer. Their house had gotten burned down. They didn't lose their job. They didn't have an emergency. Uh, they didn't, their car didn't break down. So, or they didn't get go through a divorce or whatever. There's so many life happening, life emergency. And at the end of the day, what's going to happen is their reality check going to come in. They're going to be like, man, I need more cash. Well, guess what? That's not my issue. I already have my salary, plus I'm making $8,000 a month on my way to $10,000 a month with my uh, portfolio. So, yeah. I'm continue to make money, continue to uh, continue to grow, and uh, okay. With that, what did I buy today? So today, uh, the biggest drop is uh, is AMDY. AMDY drop. Uh, wow, it came back up a little bit. It actually dropped almost four percent. So let me show you what I bought. Uh, I bought for sixteen seventy seven twenty share. So right now the current price is seventeen twelve. So it came up a little bit after uh, post market. But at sixteen seven seven I bought twenty share. That's just that's just bring my cost average down. That's all I did. And the other one I bought and I just blank out what I just bought. Um, yeah, you know what, I'm not gonna remember now. I just remember AMDY. Um, and so that's that's bit okay, so what am I saving money my money uh, what am I saving my money for? So this Thursday I'm saving to buy U L T Y. Okay. So currently, this is my makeup right now. Um, my first week is paid by QQY, IWY. So QQY is my core, IWY supporting. They both generated a thousand. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. Little cough a little bit. I have a thousand share QQY, a thousand share IWY, and they both generate almost two thousand dollars a month. Okay. And then my second week is Tesla with uh, leading uh, leading the group, and then Coney. If you combine these two and the rest of the Tesla, my second week I get about almost four thousand okay? dollars. My third week is ULTY. I have six hundred shares, so my third week is my weakest. My fourth week I have two thousand share of Clip. That's giving me a thousand dollar, and their support is Feppy F E P Y. All right. So this week I'm gonna make this a thousand shares. So I'm gonna buy four hundred share. So what we're, what I'm predicting, let's say this thing hit fifteen dollars um, by uh, by Thursday, and then the price drop, uh, we're expecting the price drop to be somewhere around a dollar twenty or so. Okay, so let's pull the calculator out. So let's say this thing is fifteen dollars. All right, and uh, minus a um, dollar twenty. So I'm looking at $13.08. So it's going to drop roughly around $13, below $14. The real is going to be below $14. So I'm able to buy a lot of more shares. So I'm going to buy 400 shares that give it to 1,000 share. All right. So that means from this point forward, so in July, I'm going to get a th minimum 1,000 share every week. Didn't matter what week it is. First week, second week, third week, fourth week, I get 1,000 share. So the next thing I'm going to grow is I'm going to grow the support to get that to 1,000 share. So think about my first week I get 2,000 share. My second week I got 4,000 share. 
and now I'm going to grow my third and fourth week to get 2,000 share also, right? All right, how I'm going to grow that? I don't need to buy any more ULTY because I got 1,000 share already. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grow Y max to 100 share in a minute, and then I'm going to try to grow to 1,000 share, all right? So eventually, I'm going to get 1,000 share across the board. So after I grow ULTY, I'm going to work on Connie to get to 1,000 share, and I'm going to work SQY to get 1,000 share, AMDY to 1,000 share, ORK to 1,000 share, AIYY. All these guys get 1,000 share, but I just do a little bit at a time, all right? So, you know, I start off, when I open a position, like crash, I, I bought one, I bought one share. That's it. That's how I open the position, one share. And then I double it, and I get two share, three shares, then four share, eight share, ten share, then 20 shares, and eventually I get to 100. Eventually I get to 150, 500, 600, and then, and, and then when, when one of those days is right, price is right, I drop, you know, big bucks on it. Um, and then get to a thousand share. Ultimately, in my portfolio, you see a thousand share all the way down. Every single one of these high yield dividends, it's all getting a thousand share. And guess what? If you know, like if a thousand share and some of them paying ninety six cents, ninety cents, and stuff like that, that means I'm getting nine hundred dollar, nine hundred sixty dollar, ninety dollar. Except OLK, gonna pay me four hundred dollars. You know, that's still good money. That's still good money. That 40 cents is still better than Chuppie, JPI, better than SCHD, better than Coca-Cola, better than anything out there. So, yeah, I'm gener I'm going to be generating a lot of income here uh, the next two three years because my portfolio just keep getting bigger and bigger. And here's the beauty of this. It doesn't matter how many videos. It doesn't matter how many hatred because nobody, nobody can influence this portfolio except me. Nobody. So there's nothing you can do about it. All you can do is watch my portfolio grow and get bigger unless I do something with this portfolio. So there's nothing in the world anybody can do to change this portfolio. Nothing. All right? And this is not my primary income, so guess what? Nothing's going to affect it. Um, and uh, so, yeah, so I'm on the right track. I, I'm continue to make money, continue to get bigger, and continue to uh, uh, be amazing. And I hope... You get a chance, uh, come hang out in our community. And um, like I said, you don't need to subscribe. You don't need to comment. You don't need to like. And we don't need anything from you. You don't need to join anything. You don't You don't even need to watch this video. You know, uh, like I keep telling people all the time that uh, I don't need fortune or fame. And I don't need to be famous in YouTube. I'm not going to get rich doing YouTube. I'm going to get rich through my portfolio. And I'm showing to you uh, on a daily basis daily situation uh yeah come in uh ask question have conversation and of course you ask the wrong question we'll ban you you troll us we ban you you piss us off we ban you you tell us we fail we ban you there's so many ways we're going to ban you it's unbelievable because like i said this is a very small group of people that want to grow their portfolio want their portfolio to get to make a lot of income uh we're looking at ten thousand twenty thousand dollars a month and and we're, we're, we don't give a damn. We don't really care what your opinion is. We'll, we'll continue doing what we're doing and we'll continue to be successful and making money. Uh, okay, so with that, I just want to say thank you uh, for watching. And I'm going to give the, the, the uh, community here a chance to say something. Uh, guys, do so you want to say something to the YouTube worlds uh, before I stop the recording? Does anybody want to say anything? Yeah, just after you were saying all of that, I just thought the song can't touch this. Uh, MC Hammer, you can't That's, touch this. Can't touch this. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing. There's nothing anybody can do to touch it. it there's nothing literally anybody can do. Um, you, I'm gonna get paid ten thousand dollar no matter what. You know, so, and uh, and and at the end of the day, my wife and my family, everybody's gonna benefit from this. You know, so, uh, hey, good luck, everyone. Peace out.